Hello, niggas. Hello, niggas. Hello, niggas. I want each and every one of you to ask yourself a question. Like, am I a nigga? Are you a mm -hmm. nigga? When I was nine years old, I was convalescing from rheumatic fever. And I was the only black kid in this convalescent home in Long Island. And the kids were abusive, these little white kids. And they were calling me nigger so much I couldn't stand it. And one day they called me nigger. And I started crying. I started crying. And I went running into the head nurse. And she said, what's the matter? And I said, the kids are, are, are calling me a nigger. And she said, well, aren't you a nigger? Am I a nigger? Am I a nigger? The first time I was called a nigger by somebody white was I was on a picket line in 1960. And somebody white in the car drove by and said, nigga, out the, out the window loud. And that was the first time. From Kenton, Louisiana, the railroad tracks separate the black and the white folks. They're niggers. They're niggers. 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 I've been in many fights over that. Handed some ass whippings out and received some. We're gonna kill you, nigga. Run. Run, nigga. Run. <laughs> Uh, first time somebody called me a nigger was uh, second grade, first day of school, little, little white girl, name was Carol. I'll, I'll leave out her last name. And it wasn't even like mean, it was like, hi nigger. What's the name of this cat? Nigger. We lived in a predominantly white neighborhood and I was probably one of... 350 kids at this elementary school and I was black and there was this little white boy that used to chase me home and call me a nigger. Honey, what's this black world coming to? And I remember going home and I remember saying, Mom, what does this word mean? Because I had never heard the word with, with such vengeance. Nigger, go home now. White boy calling, you know, walking down the street. Niggas, go home! All that kind of stuff. You know what I'm saying? But... We didn't do nothing but pick up rocks and throw it. Nigga, 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 nigga. Don't say nigga. I was probably crawling the first time somebody called me nigga. It was probably in my house uh, because I've heard it all my life. And it was probably uh, I either did something wrong and somebody said it to me as nigga stop doing that. Or somebody said, that's a cute little nigga. Am I a nigga? And if the answer is yes. Don't be ashamed to admit you're a nigger. No. I remember the first time I heard it, and I've never been really offended by it. Because the first time I heard it came out of somebody's black mouth. Once you get a job, nigger, be respectful. <laughs> Niggas ain't acting like colored people, and we can't stand that. Then when I heard a white person said, and like in the name calling, and it was like, it was used as a weapon. And too late for me. I'd heard it. It didn't do anything for me. It's the nigga you that turns you black. Black! Once you learn to hate it. Hate, hate it. it! You know what? I can't remember anyone ever calling me a nigga. I guess. You know, not in a derogatory fashion. I can't even actually think of anybody calling me a nigga to my face that wore within hearing distance ever. Who's gonna call you a nigga in New York? <laughs> Nobody. Except, you know, other niggas. God, nigga. Why you brothers and sisters? You nigga, nigga, me. nigga. Don't That's all I hear you motherfuckers racist. talking about is nigga. I think the music is a little bit hard. I ain't no nigga. Does everything out your mouth have to be a four-letter word? Talk about women is bullshit. What are you motherfuckers doing for the community anyway? Motherfucker, I got kids. I don't want them listening to that bullshit. Fuck the niggas. You motherfuckers need to stop. How could you call yourself a nigga and be proud of it? Flatline. <laughs> It's hard to hurt me with hurt me with words. I had never heard the word with such vengeance. What does this word mean? The first, the first, the first thing, first thing you need to know about. First thing you need to know about me is I'm a nigga. I'm a nigga. I'm a nigga. Who's gonna call you a nigga? You nigga in New York? Nobody. Nobody. Except other niggas. Niggas going nowhere. nowhere. He's black. He's brutal. He's boss. They call him boss. I have let people know that 
I'm an actor, I'm a nice guy, and there are a lot of things that we can get along with, but the first thing you need to know about me is I'm a nigga. And they look at me like, what? And I go, I'm not just, you know, a, a really nice color fella. I'm a nigga. And they go, well, I, Sam, I, I really don't understand. It's like, I'm one of those guys you really, really, really don't want to mess with. So, I've done things that, you know, people go to prison for, I guess. Or, I'm really, you know, not going to just you know, punch you in the face. <laughs> I'm going to do some niggardly shit to you. <laughs> Y'all niggas, and you going to be niggas forever, just like us, niggas. You're not niggas. Well, you know, I come from a different time, so... Yeah, nigga was around like that nigga's crazy. And Richard Pryor had his album. So, of course, cats would use it in the, in the hood, in the corners. There used to be some beautiful black man would come through the neighborhood dressing African shit, you know, really nice shit, you know. And they'd be, peace, love, black is beautiful. Remember the essence of life. We are people of the universe. And life is beautiful. My parents go, that nigga crazy. <laughs> But it was also a time where if you call somebody, yo, what up, nigga? You know, Cass was like, why I got to be a nigga today? Because there was a certain level of consciousness that people felt that nigga was demeaning. And they said, you know, damn, you know, why you dissing me like that? I'm talking about black people like you, nigga. Most of my friends are my generation. I mean, I'm 55. And uh, we all decry the use of it. And yet, sometimes we're fiddling around, we, we say it. Sometimes. Sometimes. But we all kind of bemoan the fact that it's used with such regularity by younger people. But that may be just old guys bitching about being old. Bullshit. Why do I call myself a nigga, you ask me? Well, that's because I'm all about that cash, G. Our community has been using the word and, and sort of trying to redefine the context of it for a long time. And a lot of people make the argument that it's destructive. It is in a lot of ways. But um, the fact of the matter is that there's a, a large segment of black people who grew up hearing the word intended as nothing but like love. Oh, nigga, please. She was smiling at me, not you. You? That's right. She's way too happening for a nigga like you. The history, the racism, um, the politics of it, that's what, you know, is at issue. It's not the word. Because, um, you know, as we know, words change over time. They can have different meanings, be used in a different context. Well, and you again, nigga. I told you. He called me a nigga. Jordan? JT. Nigga. It's like brother. 